All right, folks, Pi Guy here. I'm going to show you how to mount your uh, USB drive to a Raspberry Pi. Now, this can work on other uh, Pis also and stuff. Maybe th some things might be a little bit different, but this is mainly for the Pi. So we're just can we're just going to do a LS USB, and as you can see, I have mine plugged in right here. So we're going to do a different LS, and we're focused on the SDA1. We're not worrying about these two, so we can just clear that. Then what we are going to do, we're going to make a directory. And we can just call this whatever you feel like, but we're just going to call it USB. So if we can cd into this and here we are now we don't have nothing under here so we can always make something else if you feel like if you want to put another folder under there or whatnot if not you can just let it go so <clears throat> now we need to give that uh, directory So the Pi user has access to it. So we can just do a USB. So whatever you named it up here, you just need to change it here. So now what we need to do is we need to we can do a manual mount on this and to do a manual mount we'll do a pseudo mount SDA and we can do a USB of what we call it and we can do a dash O UID equals better just to copy this here since I have it here in front of me other than trying to type it out so we just need to run that and that will mount it now if you want it to auto mount because if you restart your Pi more than likely the mount is going to disappear so we're just going to do a pseudo nano then we need to get into the file system here and we're just going to scroll down and right here we're going to add this big line but we need to go back here and change this to whatever directory you called it so we can do something like that and all you will need to do is just save that then uh, do a pseudo reboot and your uh, USB should be good to go. Alright, I'll throw a link in the description to my website for more information on this and other things. So, stay tuned. Don't forget to hit the like and the subscribe button. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you on the next one.